Pharma company Glenmark has launched a nasal spray used to treat COVID-19. The company has launched nitric oxide nasal spray in partnership with Canadian pharma company Sanitize in India. The drug is branded as Fabi Spray. The drug, which is a topical drug and is termed casually as the sanitizer of the nose, is approved for the treatment of adult patients with COVID-19. The spray is designed to kill COVID-19 at the portal of entry or in the upper airways as the spray releases a small dose of nitric oxide. This is expected to prevent the COVID-19 virus from incubating and spreading to the lungs by providing a physical and chemical barrier. It's a very novel product. A nitric oxide nasal spray which has just received this approval. It's designed to kill the SARS-CoV-2 at its portal of entry. So it's it's highly important, you know, it, it doesn't matter that the pandemic is waning or that the variant is of uh, it's of a different variant because the pandemic is still raging across the world and there are new variants of concern that are emerging from time to time. We've seen this, I mean, we've learned in the pandemic and WHO is always, you know, insisting that we shouldn't let our guard down. The company says that phase 3 results in India met key endpoints. In fact, they said that the phase 3 trial demonstrated a 99% reduction in the viral load in 48 hours. So it's a prescription product and it's intended for use for mild patients who have risk of progression of disease. You know, in our clinical trial, it has demonstrated 99% reduction of the viral load in just 48 hours. I think it's remarkable. And it's it's a product that has demonstrated this not only in the India trial, but also replicated in the UK trial. The company says the trials in UK showed good results and while it is approved in India for treatment, it is approved in some countries for protection as well. The drug is approved in the likes of Europe, Israel, Bahrain. Yeah, so it's available in Israel, it's available in Thailand, it's available in Bahrain, it's approved in Europe. And uh, all 27 nations in Europe have received approval to market this. Of course, in other countries, it's approved for protection, but also it's also approved for patients who have recently been exposed to the virus. So in India, it's approved, of course, for treatment, uh, which is the initial indication that we have embarked upon. And of course, we will be embarking upon as a next step even for protection. Well, it is important to note that it is a prescription drug. This means that it cannot be bought freely at a chemist. Also, it is intended for mild patients who have a risk of progression of the disease. While the drug is approved in other countries, one needs to assess what the eventual efficacy of the drug is, the offtake of it, especially since COVID-19 seems to be tapering, and whether or not it will actually be added in terms of treatment protocols by regulators and doctors. Till then, experts say, tread with caution.